law is of the state of Illinois. Well, I'm just, I'm just documenting. I'll answer any question, whatever you like, but just not my interest. Thank you. Oh, I'm just documenting, sir. I'm just documenting. That's all. I'm not doing anything nefarious. I don't have any ill intent. Just want to be able to come in, file a for you, and all day. You guys close at two thirty, right? We do close at two thirty. Right. However, if you don't have a reason to be here, right, then we have to ask that you depart. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I, I can understand that, but I definitely we do agree that I do have a reason to be here, right? You have to have the reason to visit. Well, I'm not visiting the center. That's correct. So, so I'm not. Like I said, after I'm done getting a couple more shots, I'll be out of you guys' hair. So shortly thereafter, I'll be. You, you'll look up probably the next time I'll be out of here. Well, we have to ask that you leave now. Though. For for what reason, though, Lieutenant? If, if I'm telling you I'm doing something constitutionally protected, you're gonna step on that today, sir, on camera, sir. I'm just giving you your options. Time, Rich. Turn my head off. Yo, what's good, TTA family? Back at y'all with another one. Man, today we're at the Joliet Correctional Facility. Out in Stateville, Illinois. And uh, just getting ready to see if they respect our rights to record in public. And uh, we want to file a FOIA. See if they allow us to file a FOIA today. Um, you know, just make sure basically our rights are not infringed on by anyone at any time. So let's go see. Is this the visitor side over here? Yes, and, and can I go in that way as well to uh, where I, where I file it for you? Yeah, yeah, you said what goes through Springfield? Well, no, but we can file it by by law. We can file it with any public body, any agency. Right, that's my understanding here. Really? Yes, sir. Okay, yeah, I understand. But my, I'm telling you what the law is of the state of Illinois. Can we, can we, can we, can we, I don't want, I don't consent any recordings. Well, I'm just, I'm just documenting. I'll answer any question, whatever you like, but just not my interest. Thank you. Oh, I'm just documenting, sir. I'm just documenting. That's all. I'm not doing anything nefarious. I don't have any ill intent. Just want to be able to come in, file a for you, and that's it. That's it. That's it. Best of my knowledge, all FOIA requests are, are handled through Springfield, so you file them through Springfield online. Okay, so okay, so how how do I get in? This is the visitors part. Yes. Sir. Okay, and what's your what's your guys' names? I see that you're a lieutenant, right? Yeah. Okay. You lieutenant as well. Yes, sir. Okay. Is there one? Is someone of a higher authority in there? Maybe they'll know too as well that I can file it here. I have no idea. Who's in there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna just go in and see if I they'll let me file it here because I know I can. You guys probably just don't know. They don't know that they can file, a, can file it here. So we'll see. Y'all stay tuned. I'm just documenting everything. I talked to two lieutenants out there. They told me I could come in here and possibly speak to someone of a higher authority. They're trying to file a FOIA request. FOIA. I mean, if you guys don't have any forms, I'll just file. If you guys don't have the forms, I can just file it on a blank sheet and turn it in that way. We'll be good. Uh, ma'am, I'm just documenting everything, man. I appreciate that. So we uh file this for you right quick and we'll be good to go. Y'all stay tuned, TTA fan. Are you like a major or something? No, I'm a lieutenant Lu of the area. Oh, lieutenant, okay. Like I was just conveying to this young man and young lady and two lieutenants out there. Okay. I'm trying to file a FOIA request. Those lieutenants out there was trying to say, like, uh, you do it through Springfield. However, I was trying to tell them that the law states that we can do it in any public body, which this is one. 
And I turn it in, this young man was able to help me, gave me a piece of paper and a pen, fill it out, get a copy from you guys, we'll be good to go. Okay, but you're inside now. Yeah, that's correct. If you were outside, then maybe it might be something different. To file a FOIA? You? No, to, oh. help, to start a video tape. Oh, well, well, see, the only thing with this is, like, again, the state law as well, that I can document you guys, the public officials, and, of course, you guys' duties. Plus, I'm, I'm documenting my business as well. Okay. Can so, we also get your name? My, my name is James. It's cool. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? Lieutenant Okay. Appreciate it. So, uh... What was the name again? I'm sorry, James. My name? My, I just want to give James for now. Just, James just... For now? Yeah, just James, man. Okay, so um, so I'm, like I said, I'm just I got official business with the with the agency. I'm, I'm filling it out. I'm, I'll be done here shortly. Okay, but I'm just asking if you could just do it outside because fill this you, fill this out outside. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> because this is state time, and state business, a state building. Yeah, I understand. That's and that's the reason why we're able to do what we're doing. No, I understand, yeah. but it's public know, property. I understand, <laughs> yeah. but if everything is taken care of, we just have to. Oh, yeah, yeah. Once I'm done, I'm, I'm definitely going to hike on out for sure. Yeah, I'm not done filling it out, though. See? It's a, <laughs> I'm not done filling out my quest. As soon as I'm done, oh, for sure. I'm not going to hang around all day. You, you guys close at 2.30, right? Uh, we do close at 2.30. Right. However, if you don't have a reason to be here, right. then we have to ask you. Department. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I, I can understand that. But I definitely, we do agree that I do have a reason to be here, right? You have to have the reason to visit. Well, I'm not visiting the center. That's correct. So I'm not visiting any inmates or anything. I'm I'm just filing a FOIA with the agency, sir. And I, we have a we have a right to do it. Is what I'm saying. And I get everything that you're talking about. Okay. Pushing you, but if you don't have a reason to visit here, right? You have to ask where you leave. But so so just okay. Let me let me get this okay, right. This let me just get this right. This is the visiting center. Everybody, this part right here. Anybody that enters here is already on the list and pre-approved to visit. Because those other two lieutenants didn't tell me that. I asked them when I was out there talking to them. The, okay, that's fine. I, they, told, they instructed me to come in here. Well, I don't know about all that. Well, they did. Well, I, mean, I can show it to you. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I don't want you to think I'm lying. Because, I mean, because you, you see how that looked. Two other lieutenants said I can come in here and ask for a higher authority. Now that I'm here, I have another lieutenant telling me that I can't be in here filling out a FOIA. You get what I'm kind of saying? It's like it's open to the public right now. Like, why, why can't I just conduct my business? Those who are here for the business of visiting. So, so even though if you just got a couple more seconds, how much time do you need? Uh, just a just a couple of few more moments just to write this down and get, and get you guys and then I get a copy from you guys and then we'll be good to go. That's it. Of my request, just just a, just that you received it. That's it. Just finish with your business. I'm definitely trying to. All right, so. Uh, Fill his foyer out and we'll be good to go. I don't understand what's the problem. Y'all stay tuned, GTA family. It's <coughs> Lieutenant? Yeah, yeah. Can I just get a copy of that, sir? That you received it? I'm gonna leave it with you, but I just need a copy that you received it, and we'll be good to go. Huh? You you can't give me a copy. So you're so you're not gonna even accept my request. You won't make a copy. Oh wow. 
Okay, so who was who you guys' as a public information officer? Uh, you can call, you can call Springfield or even on your phone with Google Maps, and then just try and contact the board's office to make an appointment. And you can't tell me? I don't have the direct information. It's all out there, though. Okay, because I was, because I mean, if you, well, because I just want to make sure that you forward it to the appropriate person. Yeah, I've got all the video right there that you left it here. No, no, I know. I want to make sure that you're going to forward it to the appropriate person. Okay, okay. So I'm going to definitely leave it. You guys got five days to respond. She laughing. Look, she laughing. <laughs> That's the one that said she didn't want to be on camera. <laughs> Well, we good to go, man. Just want to file our foyer. Well, we should be good to go. Ah, so, uh, he didn't want to give us a copy. However, like he said, we uh, we got proof, obviously, that uh, we got proof that we did file a foyer. So, uh, we definitely should be good to go. And uh, that's how that's going to roll out. So y'all stay tuned, TTA family. Okay, this was the lieutenant right here that didn't want to give us a copy, TTA family. Yeah, that's the same one. But it's all good. I mean, at least they did take it. They was just misinformed about Springfield. They want us to go to Springfield and... Um, you know, want us to do stuff like that. And All right, sir. What's going on, Lieutenant Brown? Have you got enough footage? Just about. I'm okay. summing up everything now. Why? What's going on? Okay, so we have to ask that you depart the grounds because videotaping is not allowed on grounds. So really? I, I didn't see any signs. Division, and you can go to 53 to continue recording if you like. What's division in 53, sir? Uh, if you look to your left, that is 53. Okay. Okay. Well, on the outside where the cars are at. And if you look to the right, that's 53. That's Division Street. That's Division Street. Because I noticed to the, right. to the right. Oh, over here. Yeah. Okay. So, I mean. Uh, those are the options. Okay. Because, um, like, again, those two lieutenants that was just out here with me prior to you coming out uh -huh. said, that, said didn't say anything. Plus, I noticed that there are no signs out here saying that you can't record. Oh, yeah. And secondary, this is public property. I hear you. This is public, but we have we remain an institution. That's correct. And we have to keep the privacy, and we don't allow videotaping on grounds. And that's a policy, right? That is. And a see, policy. see, that's just it. A policy so is detriment always, is diametrically opposed to the Constitution, sir. That's why we also give you the option to, to film from down there or down here, whichever you want is your choice. Okay, I just want to get a couple more shots, and then I'll be good to go. I mean, I noticed that you like it. You know, that's. Uh, affirms the validity that this is, even though that you just did say it is public property. That's a bus stop over here and everything, Lieutenant. So, I, I mean, what you're saying doesn't make any sense, you know, with all due respect. Once again, that is for the visitors that have a reason to be here. Okay. okay. But I mean, but it's still public, though, right? It's publicly accessible. I hear you, but you right. don't see anyone over there. Oh, well, no one's there to catch the bus. That's the only reason why no one's over here. I hear you, and I also need you, know you need continuous footage by the. Oh, absolutely not. I just want to be able to make sure my rights are not infringed on today by public officials like you guys. That That's the main goal. I get it, but I'm just telling you your options for now. Okay. But like I said, after I'm done getting a couple more shots, I'll be out of you guys' hair. So shortly thereafter, I'll be, you, you'll look up probably the next time I'll be out of here. Well, we have to ask that you leave now. For, for what reason, though, Lieutenant? If, if I'm telling you I'm doing something constitutionally protected, you're going to step on that today, sir, on camera, sir? I'm just giving you your options as far as filming on grounds. That's correct. And that, this is public. We both agree that it's public property. Correct? So if I, so so what does filming, if that's not breaking the law, then what? First and foremost, we have to get approval from wardens, majors, Springfield, things of that nature. To film in public property. So I have to get, so basically, okay, okay, let me just get this right. Let me just right. get this right. This is, once again, it is online. Oh, everything that I requested. Everything that you requested is online. Okay, that's cool, but I mean, I just want to be able to come in and do it personally, in person. Right. If you don't do it the right way, that's why we have to ask you to depart. Well, I've done it the right way, Lieutenant. I, I just feel like, I feel like right now that you're, you know, you're getting ready to step into some mess, sir. Uh, and for, 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 uh, for reasons that's apparent, but... Like I said, these other two two lieutenants that was just out here said nothing. I was good to go. So I wonder why they keep sending you at me like this. Well, <laughs> this is first and foremost my assignment. I do not know about other lieutenants that were out here on grounds also. 
Oh, okay. You didn't know about those two those two young men that was just right here, standing right here? Well, he he do, the guy right here with the gun. You you know the ones we're talking about, right? No? Yes, sir. Well, no, the, the conversation huh? is really just between me and you. I mean, you, you right here, though. I mean, why? why I, I'm, huh? You, you don't have to answer anything. I didn't say that you did. <laughs> yeah, there you go. He, he, you know, <laughs> it would be all unprofessional and, 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 and rude. <laughs> Anyway, uh, we go to go get the rest of our footage, like we said, man, and then we'll buck on out. I don't see the problem. The guy that didn't want to answer us, but that was standing there with his gun, it might be officer. Uh, it looked like his name was Harper. So uh, we're just going to get a couple more shots. Like I said, we was able to file our FOIA, so we're just going to get a couple more shots, and then we out of here. Y'all stay tuned, TTA family. How you doing, man? Man, yeah, just documenting the penitentiary. Just ran in there and filed a FOIA right quick. And that's about it, pretty much. Which, are you like a lieutenant as well? It's like I'm running to all everybody I'm speaking to today as a lieutenant. No. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, hey, we hey, we on camera all day, right? <laughs> yeah, so yeah. Just was seeing while I was recording. Man, they say we on camera all day. But, you know, for the most part, though, it's all good, man. It's all good. Y'all stay tuned, TTA family. So, yeah, TTA family. Just wanted to get us. couple more shots man um now we'll be good to go man so real quick man from the top tta family from the top my thing is like i said when i approached when we approached the first two lieutenants you know what i mean they was you know one of them it was just one it was just that one the other one probably didn't really he didn't really seem like he cared about it or not sometimes you get those but it was just the one lieutenant that was like i don't want to be on camera so you know that's one thing i don't want to be on camera and everything like that. We went into the visitor center, filed our FOIA. Uh, first guy was helpful, you know, he gave me a sheet of paper to file it, you know what I mean? Gave me a pen to do so. Uh, the lieutenant though, Lieutenant Brown coming, you know, just telling me, he, you know, he's like he's trying to rush me into leaving. He wanted me to leave if you're not done here. Even while I was filling out the FOIA, he was asking me to leave. Like, <laughs> you know, so I, I, I just didn't understand that. Uh, then when we came back out, those same two lieutenants was out here. They said nothing again. Obviously, you know, I already know they're doing radio. It's a bunch of radio traffic. You know, they probably tell him, look, the guy's done. He's on his way back out. So they, obviously they seen me come back out. Everything was good to go. We were done with that, right? Started filming and documenting the gate and things like that. You know what I mean? Narrating to you guys. And uh, about after about five, maybe five or 10 minutes, here come Lieutenant Brown again. You know, I'm going to ask you if you're not, if you're done, you're going to leave. I'm trying to explain to him that it's public property. I understand that it's public property. You have a bus stop right here and everything. But he even admitted that it's public property. So that's the crazy part. You're admitting and understand and have knowledge that it is. And you still want me to leave. And I'm not doing anything illegal. You guys close at 2.30. So this is open to the public. So it just didn't make any sense. But... I think we should be good to go. He didn't give us a copy, but he did accept the FOIA. Told me all the information that I uh, requested is online. They always tell you that, though, so you can go online. And it's all good, though. But, uh, you know, like I told you, they got five days. The lady in the cubicle, she was all, like, laughing and stuff. When I said, you guys got five days, she started cracking up, like, like as if that was my rule. You know, they've been ruling over inmates for so long that they feel like, you know, if someone else tells them something that they don't have to listen, you know, right away she was, I don't want to be on camera. These people, man, these people is, they all over the place, man. But in any event, I think we should be good to go. Uh, man, I want to appreciate everybody that's been tuned in with TTA, man. I love you guys wholeheartedly, man. Real talk. Uh, if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscription button, man. You know what I mean? We got a lot of big announcements coming up, man. You guys don't want to miss that. Uh, we'll be back live at 2 p.m. Central. Sunday, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. 2 p.m. Central, we'll be back live again. If you guys want to get to uh, TTA merch, go to ttafamily.com. 
and get all your TTA merch. It's not letting me tag it in the description, so I'm gonna try to put it as the first comment on this video, ttafamily.com. And uh, we should be good to go. Let me think, is there anything else that I need to? Nope, that'll be about it, man. So until the next time, man, y'all stay tuned with me.